Welcome back everyone. You may be in a position where you want to go ahead and turn off 5G on your iPhone SE 3. Now there's reasons to do this mostly because 5G is still you know being developed and also it'll save a little bit of battery life if you wanted to. So what you can do here to turn it off what you want to do is you want to make your way over to your settings application like this and you want to go ahead and click on your cellular option right here. Now you want to make sure you have a sim card installed. Unfortunately I don't have a sim card installed so I'll have to do this via screenshots but you want to click on your cellular option right here. And when you do that, you'll come into a panel that looks something like this. Now, what you want to do here is you want to go ahead and click on the cellular data options that's right there. So it should be right under cellular data. Just click on cellular data options. And what will happen here is you'll come into a panel that looks like this. Now, what you can do is you can, you know, kind of configure your 5G however you want it to. So you'll see a voice and data option. You may see a data option as well. So what you want to do is you want to go and click on voice and data and you'll basically come into this panel. Now, when you're on this panel, you can go ahead and configure this however you want to. You can have it on 5G on, 5G auto, and you can do LTE. Now, these options may change in the future, but you can see with 5G on, it uses 5G whenever it is available, even when it may reduce battery life. With 5G auto, it uses 5G only when it will not significantly reduce battery life. So that's a big thing you can do. You can also just maintain it all LTE. LTE is basically 4G. So if you want it to be you know, not on 5G, you want to click LTE, and that's pretty much how you do it there. Now, if you make your way back into this settings panel, you can actually go ahead and under data mode, you can go ahead and actually configure a little bit more. So you can allow more data on 5G. You can also do standard and low data mode as well. But that's pretty much it. That's how you go and configure this however you want to. If you have any other questions or anything like that, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. That would mean so much. But definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.